Good morning. Today is Friday, August the 26th, the year 2022. And it is with great sadness and anger that I come to you this morning. And I would like to address the postal services mainly, mainly USPS and UPS. And I read a 61 year old postal carrier died after being attacked by five dogs in rural northern Florida over the weekend. Sheriff's official said, Last year, the state ranked among the top 10 for such attacks, with more than 5,400 postal workers across the U.S. victimized. I will read that again. 5,400 postal workers across the United States has been victimized in 2021 alone. The postal worker who was killed, her name was Pamela Jane Rock of Melrose was in the Interlaken Lakes Estates area on Sunday after her vehicle broke down, according to the Putnam County Sheriff's Office. The assault on Rock was especially gruesome, with a Authorities not ruling out criminal charges against the owner of the dogs. There were 201 dog attacks reported last year in Florida, according to the USPS. California led the state rankings in dog attacks on postal workers with 656 assaults in 2021 alone, followed by Texas with 368 such incidents. Ohio, Pennsylvania, and Michigan rounded out the top five states for canine attacks. I want to know where is the protection for these service workers? This is unacceptable. Unacceptable. You mean a postal worker can't even go and deliver mail without losing their life? you want your mail. Can't wait until the mailman comes. You can't wait until the mailwoman comes. But you know what? They might not make it. Yeah. They might not make it to your stop. You know why? Because your neighbor's dog killed them. That's why. Your neighbor's dog tore them apart. That's why.
Can you tell I'm not upset? I want to know why there isn't more protection for the postal mail carriers from these killers. If is it man? If your dog attacks a postal worker, you have forfeited the rights to have your mail home delivered. You heard me. Go and pick up your mail from one of those drop-ins mail places. Go to the post office. No, 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 sir, no, ma'am. No, no, no. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. No. You have forfeited your rights to have your mail home delivered. Go and pick up your fucking mail from the post office or from whatever drop-in center. They have portable post office boxes, go pick up your mail there. One time! One time! I'm only giving your dog one time! That's your dog. You are the owner. You are the master. You train that dog. You know when we're coming by. You know who we are. you believe doing something so mundane on the job cost you your life my condolences goes out to the rock family because not in a million years would that family have thought that they would lose their loved ones on a fucking postal route. Even armored vehicles, security guards have more protection than a postal service worker. Just want to know where their protection. They deserve to be protected. They deserve to have laws enacted to protect them after all. Without them, without, without our postal workers, we would be screwed. We, we still get everything through the mail. Important documents, a passport, a new ID, credit cards, debit cards. Your marriage license. I can go on and on and on with divorce decree. <laughs> but you, this enrages me so much. I'm so angry. USPS. <laughs> you could protect them from the vaccine, but you can't protect them on their routes. Because after they get bit, they're going to need a vaccine, right? What is it, a tetanus shot? <laughs> they're going to need an injection, anyways. You can't trust that the dog isn't healthy. But why? Why is this happening over and over and over and over? You know why? I'll tell you why. Because these dog owners are not being held accountable. People are looking at the dog. Oh, the dog is innocent. And it don't, you're right. You're right. Let's deal with the owners of these dogs. 
let's put in place some laws. Let's protect these workers. It's not fair. It's not fair and it's not right and you know it. UPS. UPS, you have drivers falling out because of 100 degree weather. Why? Why is this happening? Are you trying to tell me, UPS, you are a multi billion dollar company? Are you trying to tell me? That you can't outfit your fucking workers with up-to-date technology trucks and vehicles. To weather the conditions, the changing conditions outside. Bullshit! Bullshit! Don't give me that. Don't give me that. I'm wearing your uniform. I'm wearing your name. United States Postal Service. United Postal Service. Where are their protection? Where's my protection? Postal, where's my protection? I'm working for you. I'm working for the public. I'm working for the citizens of America. And you got me fucking dying out here? Men and women are actually passing out from heat exhaustion in the UPS trucks. In other words, they're being worked to death. United States Postal Service workers are being mauled to death. And the UPS service workers are being worked to death. You need to pay me more money. If I'm going to die on the job, because of your negligence, you need to pay me more. No fuck that. No. No, sir. No. I've always wanted to work for the postal service. But after reading this article, listen, I had no idea. There was so much dog attacks carried out and has been going on. This is something that has been going on for a long time now. And the government has not stepped up. Can we blame the government? No. We have to blame the postal service. Listen to me. If you don't know the postmaster general, they have a lot of power. Oh, fuck, yeah. You see the pandemic? When everything was shut down, these motherfuckers were still going. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because rain, sleet, snow, fall, pandemic, hurricane, earthquake, that motherfucking mail is going to get delivered. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, you didn't know that. Oh, yeah. When a street is blocked off and nobody else can get through, that motherfucking postal truck, that can get through. Mm -hmm. That is federal, on the federal level. That meal got to be delivered. So that's why I don't understand what I'm reading. I don't understand 